Governor-elect Josh Shapiro and Lieutenant Governor-elect Austin Davis spending the afternoon volunteering in Harrisburg. Fox 43's Harry Lee reports on how they say the day of service fits into the Shapiro administration's agenda. Continuing a tradition started by Governor Tom Wolf, MLK Day was a day of service for Governor-elect Josh Shapiro and Lieutenant Governor-elect Austin Davis. The two men joined hundreds of volunteers working on projects like fleece blankets for people experiencing homelessness and literacy kits for kids in local schools. We are leaning in on this sense of service and showing that will be what our administration is focused on, serving others. And it's what I'll be talking about in my inaugural address, the sense of service to others, that each of us has a responsibility to do our part. Some volunteers were surprised to see the future officials in person. Making sure that they're with the people rather than just saying that they are with the people and not being out here. It's really good to see. The event comes just a day before Shapiro and Davis are sworn into office. Davis will be the first African-American lieutenant governor in Pennsylvania's history. To have our swearing in the day after Martin Luther King Day is really significant, given my place in history and Pennsylvania's history. And it's a symbol that, you know, if you work hard here in Pennsylvania, you can achieve anything. Shapiro comes into the governor's office while the future of the state house is still up in the air. A near tie between Democrats and Republicans is jeopardizing which party will be in the majority. While that could curtail Shapiro's legislative agenda, he says he's not worried. They'll sort it out there, um, and obviously the special elections in a, in a couple, or it has three weeks or so, um, will help sort that out. Preparations are underway at the Capitol for the inauguration, which is scheduled to begin at noon tomorrow. Harry Lee, Fox 43 News.